Opened way back in 1841, some 121 years ago, the old Adelaide Jail has seen over 300,000 inmates pass through these very doors. The old Adelaide Jail is a surviving relic of South Australia's colonising past, and even though it was closed and decommissioned back in 1988, it still holds to this day haunting stories within her stone walls. So, welcome to uh, the Adelaide Jail. My name is Colleen, and I'm one of the site interpreters here. This is Thomas Horton's story. So, Thomas Horton is the 25th person to be executed here at Adelaide Jail on May 12th, 1904 for the willful murder of his wife, Florence. So despite having this serious fall as a young child, he was successful in his life and became an amateur juggler and apparently Australia's greatest juggler. After Thomas left England and arrived back in Adelaide, he found that his wife, Julia, had tragically passed away. Thomas then remarried shortly after to Florence Lovell. Um, it was quite an abusive, jealous relationship. On the evening of February 27th, 1904, and this happened actually on Rundle Street at the Adelaide Arcade, and that is where he fatally shot her. So the media actually sensationalized this story. It was like a soap opera in the newspapers. And so the, the, the trial was very public, and eventually um, he was found guilty and hanged at Adelaide Jail. So um, he actually, while he was here at the Adelaide jail, did try an escape attempt. He actually uh, got on the inner wall, and but he was uh, captured shortly after, so he didn't get very far. And then and there was a modification that was made to the jail. It takes a desperate prisoner to risk their life on a brick wall. Admittedly, there wasn't much to lose in his case anyway. After climbing along the railing of the upper floor condemned cells, Thomas Horton used the little brick ledge in the red brick wall to help his escape. To make sure this never happened again, the jail's owners used cement to smooth the ledge. This was never a problem again. So this is the Ramon Center here, and apparently it's one of the most haunted areas in Adelaide Jail. So some people experience when they come into this building, something watching them above. Sometimes um, some ex people experience like a little tickle or a little tug on the, the back of their hair. And apparently that only ever happens to Females with long hair, like me, but I've never experienced it, but my manager did. 